WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the uh, Dow Industrials up 60, NASDAQ up 9, S&P's flat. Gold contract also flat trading at 1479.70 an ounce. We have silver down 6 cents, $17, 4 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up 70 cents, trading $60.91. Let's get over to that light sweet crude market, take a look at it, because what light sweet crude is doing right now, folks, is that it is going after the highs that were established out here the day that the uh, Saudi oil fields got bombed. And uh, bottom line is that uh, that only had traded up there for a few hours and then gave it up in spades. The, the number we're looking at up here is $61.48. And uh, bottom line, we've hit 61.06. I expect uh, that number is going to get hit. Notes and bonds. Bottom line, notes and bonds are flat out here today. Uh, notes and bonds continue to want higher price. What we had out here yesterday is that notes and bonds went down. They rejected a uh, lower price. Uh, Bottom line, they continue to want higher price, lower yield. Right now, you have the 10-year up 1 at 128.14. 30-year down 2 at 156.25. And King Dollar, King Dollar up 195 ticks, trading 97.214. King Dollar looks like it's building cause to get down to that 95 area. The Euro is at 111. The yen is at 109 and a half. And the pound is at 131 to 1 U.S. dollar. The pound is... What got the dollar higher out here today, the pound got smacked right down to the price point where it was prior to Johnson having that decisive victory over in the UK. Uh, what you had out here is that uh, we had just gone from a price point of a 135 back to 131, and we had started off, folks, at 131.59. Right now, you're actually underneath that. You're at 131.24. And uh, bottom line, will uh, I suspect that this is just a retracement in a move that does want to go higher because the pound itself uh, has been on a tear for quite some time, meaning prior to the election, uh, the pound has been moving higher for about four or five weeks. Notes and bonds. We take a look at that note and bond market. Bottom line, note and bond market just refuses to give it up. If we look at the 10-year right now, what you're going to see is that you're down one, you get 774,000 contracts traded. That's anemic volume. That is saying you still want higher price, lower yield. Stay right there, folks. Next 60 Minutes of Trading, closing up this great Tuesday afternoon. Come right back.